This is Mr. Tenner. I have another boot unboxing and first impression video for you guys today. Today we're going to be taking a look at a boot from Ariat. This is the Ariat Rambler Phoenix Western Boot. So let's go ahead and dive on into this and we'll give you guys a look at this boot. So packaging, uh, same, more of the same from Ariat. These boots do come wrapped in this kind of tissue paper plastic. It's got some cardboard uh, in between them to protect them in shipping. So let's go ahead and get these out of the box. Let's go ahead and get this box out of the way. And let's take a look at these quickly here. Let's remove the cardboard and the shaft. We have some cardboard here in the toe. More cardboard here in the shaft with some paper and more tissue paper in the toe. All right, there we go. We've got this Phoenix boot. Um, out of the box, unpackaged, and all that stuffing out of the way. I have to say, first impressions, I really do like this um, stitching that they have on the toe. It very much lives up to that Phoenix name. Now, this is a more modern take on a cowboy boot, if you will. This is the Rambler line, so it's not a traditionally built boot. Um, it is kind of a broad square toe. It doesn't have a Goodyear welt or anything. There is some stitching here, but I believe the main function or the way that they attach this full one-piece rubber sole to this boot is through glue. Now, it does have a heel. It's kind of a tapered heel. Uh, it's about an inch and a half to an inch and a quarter, uh, depending on where you look at it. But it is their Duratread sole, so it's mostly rubber. So this would be a great boot out in the weather and the elements. This upper shaft, you kind of carry through that Phoenix feather motif, if you will. You have the Phoenix here on the toe and on the shaft. It is a not really a lined shaft, it's just a single layer of kind of really thick leather here on this upper shaft. So what I'm gonna do now is go ahead and slip these on, I'll give you guys my first impressions, but before we get into that, wanted to mention, if you do like this boot and would like to purchase it, I will have a link in the description below. If you click on that link, it is helping and supporting my channel, so I'd like to thank you for that. So let's go ahead and get these on and give you guys my first impressions. All right, I'm back and I've paired a pair of Ariat M4 relaxed straight leg jeans with the Rambler Phoenix to give you guys a look at this combo. First impressions, I really like this Phoenix uh, stitching on the toe of this boot. I think it gives it a very unique look. I especially like the uniqueness of this Rambler sole. It's very different than most of the other Ariats that I've reviewed. Um, it's a much more pliable rubber sole. Um, it is, of course, a modern take on a Western boot with this unique square toe. It doesn't have a Goodyear welt. It is more of a cement bonded construction. But I think this is a type of boot you want to pick up for something very durable for out in the elements. It's going to hold up really well. It's going to take some abuse and keep moving. And speaking of that, this is a more entry-level priced boot from Ariat. These retail for about 180 bucks. First impressions, I really like this boot. It has a very unique look. I think it would look really good with more dark colored jeans, uh, darker clothing. I think it, it has a pretty unique look. The upper shaft is very different. It is a single layer thick leather as I mentioned and it has that stitching again that has the the feathers if you will the replicate or extend the phoenix embossing here throughout this entire boot it does have a good amount of lip so your blue jeans will stack nicely I, I believe this boot will hold up well especially at its entry level price point so that has been my full review of the Rambler Phoenix Western Boot by Ariat. Now, if you do like content like this, please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. That really does help me to bring additional content.